one more time back in the store looking at a few more products, not giving them actual scores this time because it's just way too subjective, too many variables, but I'll try to give you a few more tips. Looking for a budget option, this one actually is one of the better choices. It is cheaper than most options here. It is whole grain, simple ingredients, only seven grams of sugar per bar. The, the main drawback I see is bioengineered food ingredients. I don't like that. Otherwise, this actually could do the job. And then there's the old classic Nature Valley Crunchy Bars. A little bit of stuff the same, 22 grams of whole grain per, per serving. That's counting as two bars. But if you cut that on 11 and more equivalent to other bars, it's still not bad. And that means the sugar is only five and a half grams. It's one of the lower sugar options. Very simple ingredient list, whole grain, low sugar. Ding is, it's bioengineered food ingredients, but actually not too bad of a choice. My preferred choice tends to go to one of the whole grain options. And organic is what I meant to say is organic. This one is, these are all organic choices. They have to pass the kid test though as well. This is 10 grams of whole grain per serving um, and 10 grams of added sugars. Very sim fairly simple ingredients, but again, there's no perfect bar option. It has more ingredients on the list, eight grams of whole grain per serving only and 12 grams of sugar. It's tasty though, but there are some drawbacks. This is one of the higher ones on our list because it passed the kid test, 11 grams of whole grain. It's almost 10 grams of sugar, unfortunately but it's really simple ingredients and it's organic. This one's made with super grains and, and just generally quality ingredients, fairly simple ingredients and good stuff in there with low sugar as well. All the same.